Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to update the navigation map and software update on Hyundai 2024 and 25 model. First of all, you need a USB pen drive maximum capacity of 32 GB. Make sure USB type C, Hyundai support only uh, C for this specific model. So I am using uh, this one uh, Dual Drive Go, which uh, brand is SanDisk, USB type C and uh, also to, to USB type A as well. So I already plugged in here to my computer. Now let's jump into the software update process. For this, uh, you have to visit uh, update update.hindai.com. From here, you can see there is a notification dated February 26, 2025. It says navigation map and software update. So here you have to click uh, navigation and uh, software update. From here, you have both version. So I have a Windows computer. I simply click Windows download the file is downloading yeah soon after the downloads i will install uh, you can see the screen after that uh, you have to select the country so it seems i am in middle east i will click middle east and uh, next then uh, you can select the brand or oh, genesis kia hyundai so i will click hyundai then next then you can select the version so i am i prefer english then uh, next then you have to agree for this uh, license contract see here so i accept then next so now the software is installing you can see here a navigation updater install now installing the navigation updater so after the installation, see you can see from uh, the navigation software is installed already. Now here it's preparing for the USB installation. So now you have to click OK. From here uh, it's asking uh, how to find your navigation system and software version. So you know you can find it all this from your uh, vehicle and uh, you say you can say okay and uh, from here this is the important part here you have to download uh, you have to select the model your vehicle uh, so my one is uh, santa fe 2020 yeah santa fe 2025 so after that uh, you can click okay then uh, uh, e already uh, this pen drive is detected here e, uh, so I will click next it says uh, formatting will delete all the data on the portable device yeah of course uh, uh, I'm using this uh, pen drive only for this purpose only so I would click yes then uh, it will uh, now started to install, I mean downloading and installing uh, to the USB pen drive. So it will take uh, nearly uh, 10 minutes. Yeah, installation is almost 99% finished and uh, uh, there is a few more seconds to go. But you have to patiently wait uh, till finished 100%. Uh, now yes installation is done uh, it says download uh, completed uh, then now what you have to do is close the program yeah you have to close the program yes now you have to remove the USB here so you have to remove this uh, eject this USB pen drive yeah now let's go and see in the car so now what I'm going to do is, uh, now I'm going to put the USB pen drive uh, to this specific uh, port, see this, and make sure this orange light should uh, indicate here. If you press this one, this is only for 
for charging your phone or you know for that purpose only but for again if you press this one this is this is the one you have to uh, use for this software update purpose so soon after that you will see here from the screen uh, to start copying the latest software we will notify you when the installation is ready to start do not remove the USB flash drive until you receive a notification so what I'm going to do is uh, I will start this one Bismillah see it's automatically there is a update is going on see this one the, I think uh, the file uh, is copying to the system see it says update there are ongoing updates preparing to install the navigation software so we'll wait and see Yeah, now it says uh, the update will start when the vehicle is turned off. Navigation is not available during the update. Takes up to 10 minutes. Yeah. So let's uh, off the engine. Select update now to immediately start the latest software update or select update after the vehicle is turned off to schedule the software update to start as soon as the vehicle is turned off the update takes about 10 minutes the navigation system will be unavailable during the update available during the update yeah uh, I prefer to update now See the update will start so now now it started to update. See keep the vehicle engine running to smoothly perform the update. During the update all features including the rear camera and audio are restricted. Okay. Let's wait and see. <laughs> 